Hi everyone, this is take two of this because my first video went a bit, um, first bit went a bit funny. Um, so I'll start again afresh. So this is item 68, um, before I go on to Cindy Utter's pick 10. So, um, yeah, I was just playing with some Tim Holtz crayons and some stash, so there's like gilding wax, wooden embellishments that I've, um, coloured with a felt tip and then embossed with um, some embossing powder and added some bling. So I just want to show you th that before I got started. Um, obviously because the camera went a bit funny I've already done a little bit off this um, pick 10. So uh, yeah the pick 10 was one was white space so um, that doesn't have to be white card it can be like you could have navy card but leave some of the navy so it just means like having some space. Excuse me, I had a haircut. Uh, number two is to use gelettos, but I haven't got them, so I'm using Tim Holtz crayons through a stencil. So I've just scribbled some to the side of me, and I'm just going to spray with water. I did originally use the pink, but my pink has run out, so um, I've got a little bit of a mixture of colours now. So I've got like a pink and a teal. So as you hopefully can see, let me just see. Yeah, you can. Down, in, let me come in a bit. Yeah. Um, down in the corner, there's a little bit there. Um, it's coming up very faint because obviously it's, um, it's a crayon. So it's not coming up as if I'm going, you know, mad. So just... Yeah, for some reason my crayons are going a bit, not wanting to play, play ball. So I'm just going to try some more water on that. They've crumbled, so they're not going like into a cream like they normally do. So I don't know if they go off at all. I um, don't know much about, um, too much on that. But yeah, um... And Michelle Stratford was asked for me how you can use them. So yeah, you can colour them onto a glass cut, cutting mat and then water them down and sponge them through a stencil. So that's one way. I'm just going to move that to one side and pop that in there. I'm just going to clean up the chalks as well. Chalks, the crayons. Let me just clean up the little mess I've got going on here, which is, yeah, it's really weird. Normally when you spray the crayons, they go really crumbly, um, into a paste, but I don't know why they're not this time, but never mind. Right, um, or you could scribble them and then um, put the stencil over the top and ink out through. So number three is a Sharpie, and I'm just going to grab that. Yeah, with these videos, I will have to um, get up and down and get bits of if you're new to my channel. Um, I've only got three Sharpies. It's, um, so yeah, I've just got like the standard fine point green. So um, yeah, just using Sharpies. I'm not sure quite what I'm going to do. I think I might just draw some lines. So let's turn that up that way. And still try and remember to keep white space which knowing me probably won't happen um, yeah so I'm just gonna doodle this so if you don't want to fast forward through any bits then please do so I wouldn't hate for anybody to just sit and watch me <laughs> scribble yeah um, but if you're new to this um, Cindy Utter does a pick 10 every month and if you haven't got what um, the supplies she has then improvise like I didn't have gelato so just yeah improvise so I think I'm going to leave that like that no I'm not I'm going to put just being me I need something in the middle of that yeah so I've been I don't know how long I think she did it last year but I um only came across her really this year um she also does the She's one of the people from my year 27 group, which is really good. And I've just found out they're going to do it for 2018. So I'm really pleased about that. So I will carry on with that. Right, so that is Sharpies. I'll put that back later. So let's just put that. 
I'm going to have to tick off what I've done because I know I won't remember. So white space, Tim Holtz crayon, Sharpies. And then it's got um, tinted paste. So I am just going to get me some paste. Let's slap it on. So, well, I haven't got paste, but I've got gel medium, so I'll improvise. And then I'm just going to get some paint so I can tint it. I'm going to use, sorry, having to hear me go around, but um, I could pause cameras, but um, if you're new to my channel, it's, um, I get a bit annoyed, but it takes so long to do, and these already take a while to upload, so, um, come here. Um, so editing as well just takes even longer and it holds up my internet. So if I need it for anything else, um, then it's just a bit of a pain. And I'm going to tint it with the Indigo English Cottage, oh, so I'm out of breath. Whew. English Cottage Artistic Acrylic Paint and this is Banana Custard. So I'm just going to add that in. In you go. Right, let's mix this up. I think it's quite nice that you can um, colour the texture, paste, and stuff like that because if you do want a hint of colour, I think it's um, it's a nice idea. So let's put the lid back on there before I ha end up with yellow paint everywhere. I'm sure, the landlord wouldn't be happy with that. Oh yeah, and I'm doing my. Um, I think I'm going to put that slap bang in the middle. Yeah, doing my video today, I wasn't planning on doing video today, it's Friday, um, but unfortunately my landlord is um, being poorly with a tummy blood, bless him, his whole family's ended up with it, so, um, so yes, he um, couldn't come down, so I'm just, um, hopefully we'll hear from him over the weekend of when he does, oops, I put some there, didn't want some there. Um, when he's hoping to next come down and do it, bless him. But yeah, so um, he did sound really poorly because a couple of friends teased me, going, oh, he doesn't want to come down. And I was like, no, it's not that he is generally not well. And I think um, it's just one of those things, you can't help it. So, got that there. I might put a bit down. There, this is one of my favourite stencils. It's an... Um, it's the Dutch Dabidu range. I'm never very good at saying it. Some there. Right. So I um, I am probably going to have to do this video in parts. So because um, obviously I want to clean up my mess. So yeah, I'll be back for. So I apologise that it's going to be in parts, but I am not going to be. Um, editing it all together so I will be back for part two see you in a bit bye